Hi guys, welcome to Broke Ass Reaver. How can you buy any Reaver if you're always broke? I'm going to show you another way today with a do-it-yourself sump for my 75. It's been running for close to three years now. I've been very happy with it. The water change was also with a new sump change where I made my quarantine tank into my new sump. It comes down, got a filter sock. Wet dry, biomedia comes up through a, another filter. Got biomedia pump to my new algae scrubber, which is doing very well if that's algae and not uh, bacteria. Red slime comes out of there through another final filter to clean the water and pump up so I don't know if that was and when I did this all my bio material my bio material went dry except for this that stayed good but all this went dry so I don't know if it's having to cycle again or what the deal is but I got a great new filter I think and here we are two and a half years later and I'm still using the same 45 40 gallon breeder as my custom sump I've added a few things made a few changes um, I moved the algae scrubber to the other side with the return pump to make room for a protein skimmer I also got rid of the bio balls the dry part anyways no and the bottom. I got some rock down in the bottom there. So it's just a filter sock now with some live rock filter. We've got the new skimmer. I also added a fan here which blows over my algae scrubber and acts as a radiator and keeps my tank cool. I was getting a little warm there when I added a new more powerful return pump. So this thing is still working great and my 75 is looking great that's how the broke ass reefer does it 